Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, my name is Karen. I'm a lefty who loves fountain pens, hobonichis, and planning. And if you like that type of content, hope you can subscribe. In today's video, I will be sharing with you my thoughts and experience on the Mont Blanc Service Center. So in particular, here in the Philippines, in Manila, Rustans is the... I think sole or exclusive distributor of Mont Blanc and that also includes the International Service Center. So if you purchase a Mont Blanc from the store, you have one year service warranty and part of that provision includes using the pen with Mont Blanc accessories such as, you know, inks. If they found out that you have not been using uh, Mont Blanc inks, then the warranty is void. So if you're still within the one year warranty, then I highly suggest just using the Mont Blanc inks. They're actually really great. And what I have here is the Glacier Blue. So this pen, I had this serviced because, because way back in November, I just noticed something and I will share with you a clip. So as you can see, the nib part had some, you know, chipping off if that's the right term the coating the ruthenium coating came off while it's still under warranty it's still under one year i immediately went to the mont blanc service center it's in the fifth floor of first dance makati if you haven't been there and that's the same service center for uh, cartier timepieces as well so i sent it around early December and right now it is March 1st. I got this pen back on February 27. When I got this pen back, I didn't have time to test it because the service center didn't have inks to test it with and by the time that I picked up the pen, it was near closing so I didn't have time to go down to the boutique and you know test um, the inks there with the nib. So today, I just want to share with you my thoughts and experience and see how the repair went. And if you have been following my channel, this is actually my most expensive pen. And this is what the nib looks like now. I have here some close-ups of the nib and associate told me that because of the chipping at this part here at the breather hole, repairing it would be too costly. So they actually had the entire nib replaced with a new one. So this is a new fine nib that was put in this pen and my reaction was that oh gosh had i known that they will replace the entire nib i should have requested for an extra fine nib and you know me being a lefty and a side writer i really appreciate putting less ink um, to avoid smudging so what we'll do today is we'll do a writing sample and maybe just fill her up because i want to use this pen and see how it writes or how it works and this is why i have glacier blue with me so let us fill the pen with ink That's how the ink looks like. So pretty. I think it matches the pen really well.
I have here my Hobonichi Weeks and we can do a sample writing here. Okay, so I hope this angle is better. Maybe let's do a sample here. And here is the writing sample using the glacier blue. And of course, the F is something that's acceptable. But of course, I will always go to my default nib, which is the extra fine. The pen writes smoothly. The nib has that perfect amount of feedback. The scratchiness isn't there. But I also didn't notice that from my previous um, pen. It's just that the coating has probably rubbed off. But I did some reverse writing and I'm not sure if that led to it. But anyway, um, I'm just happy that I was able to have the entire nib replaced. But if I had to do it all over again, I would have probably asked to have it changed to an extra fine nib. And I wouldn't mind waiting an extra month or two um, as long as i have that extra fine nib i would be very happy but overall i'm really happy with the service that mont blanc provides and of course i think that's already a given since they are a luxury brand and that goes without saying that you will always demand the best out of any writing instrument and that also includes this one if you are new to fountain pens and you have that uh, disposable income you can start with the meister stuck they're always classic elegant and timeless pieces you can definitely enjoy the after sales that comes with it you can have the nibs replaced to your liking they have a ton of varieties but they don't have those music nibs or the italic nibs so yeah just manage also your expectations and of course if you are going to buy a mont blanc pen then i highly suggest that you partner it with a mont blanc ink because i think you know obviously they're made for each other for now i am really enjoying my mont blanc pens with my mont blanc inks um that is a choice you don't need to do that there are a lot of affordable and really good quality fountain pens out there and i hope to share them with you uh, in future videos yeah. thank you so much for watching if you've enjoyed this video hope you can give it a thumbs up and i will see you in my next video
Bye, guys.